It's me and I'm back. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. Guys, I don't know if I shot a video about this. Video about this yesterday or the day before. I might have shot a couple and deleted it. I don't know if I actually got this out. But this is really coming back to me again. So, we're going to speak on it then, perhaps. Hang on. Well, folks, I do apologize because I freaking lost it. Maybe it'll come back. Let's, um, dang it, it was so good too, so it will come back. Maybe it's not time. Oh, yes. Thank you. Came back. Cleanse and detoxify, giving and receiving. Interesting how those come out like that all the time. So, when, let's just, I know, I think I'm like, uh, let's just talk about past people, past relationships. I know, I know what I said, I know what I said, and I meant it when I said it. But now I mean this when I say it. Okay. I did shoot a video about this already, I believe. Anyway. What? <sighs> yeah, I already did shoot a video about this, so never mind. I'm not going to visit it. But for some reason, I'm being brought back to it. And, and it's like this. It, what I'm being brought back to is... I'm just cleanse and detoxify again. You know, we've been in relationships and we've done things. You know, we've been in bad relationships. <clears throat> and not really bad. It was a choice, right? And in our choices. And in our choices. We have all right. I just went totally. I can't do this and think about what I was wanting to do. So six of fire. Big daddy. Standing strong in your in your grounding in your pentacles, right? In your earthly things. And this just flew out again. What are these? What is that? Ace of Air. Five. Anyway, um, you know, what did we learn? Like, there's people in my past, exes that uh I will still talk to you on occasion, once in a while. Not all the time, but once in a while. We still have, um, I just heard, because we're grown-ups. <laughs> but, and, and we weren't necessarily the nicest, maybe, to one another. Maybe one was worse, you know, not worse, but, you know, we both played a part in our relationship. Okay? I'm not going to say one was worse than the other. We both played a part. It takes two to tango, baby. So... Regardless of what that looks like. But, and how, and why, am I still able? Why do we still speak on occasion? Because I guess the basis of that, what am I trying to say, Serena? What are you really trying to get at? What I'm really trying to get at is, now, is dropping all that. BS from what had happened before. What do I mean? I'm, I'm, what I'm trying to say, what I'm really trying to say is letting all of that shit go. You don't have to be in that. You don't ever have to talk to them or any kind of situation. But let the shit of the past go. You're not going to change people. You can only do your part. 
What's your part? What is your part in that? Forgiveness. Forgiving yourself and forgiving them. And yeah, and coming out renewed. This is your renewal. This is your time to free yourself. How you're birthing something. Look at that creation. You know? This, this is... The only thing that will ever hold you back is you. You don't have to talk to people, family, any friend, anything if, if they weren't. Look at all these major arcanas coming out. What does that one say? Balance, yeah. You don't have to. I had to look and see if somebody sent me a message or whatever. I, we don't have to stand in that power. And you don't have to talk to them anymore. But, you know, do yourself a favor and have self-forgiveness. But... What did you learn? Remember, everything is a learning. You made a choice. You made a choice to be in that relationship. You made a choice to do this. You made a choice to do that. It was your choice, your consequences. Nobody else is doing anything to you. This is accountability. We're in the age of accountability. Age of accountability. And acceptance. They call it Aquarius. I call it accountability. <clears throat> you heard? <laughs> anyway, that's it because you know what? I just don't want to stay. All of these are freaking. You're watching me, right? Or maybe you can't see. Maybe we'll do this so you can. Okay. Age of accountability. Hmm. <laughs> Opposition competing. It's your own mind. Stand strong. Here, you're the leader. The leader of the pack. The leader of your mind. The leader of your chakras. I don't know. It reminded me of chakras for some reason. And then the other one was this. What is this? What does this say? Celebration. What? Bringing all of these together in cohesion. Okay? What? Lovers and friends. I want to be your lover. I want to be your friend. But those already know, those have been in my life and those I've spoke to. If you ever want to be in my life, it's not going to be on a sexual thing. you got to put a ring on it, baby. In a sense. I'm, I'm, you know, my body is my temple. And to have access to this temple, look up divine, look up kingdom spouse, look up divine partnerships. That's what I'm after. We can be friends, but I'm not going to just jump in bed. Yeah. <clears throat> you don't know me. That's the old me, G. The unhealed, the looking for love, the, the finding it in all the wrong places because it's the only way I knew. But that's another story for another time. Remember I showed you these? Look at this. This is what's showing up. And this is here. And then we have this. What is this? I want to be your lover. I want to be your friend. There was a seven of something else, and then here's the seven of. Oh. Seven of earth and seven of water. I'm going to make. <clears throat> Speaking of grounded, I need to get grounded right now. Um, Watch your ears because I'm going to ring my bell, okay? Because a bell isn't a bell until you ring it. Correct? I had to clear energies out. A selenite. I really don't have to do the bell. I just like the bell because it, it helps me to... Um, I just like it. I like the ring and the ding, ding, ding of it. Remember noisy theatrical, this is where we are. But 
You know, you guys, um, wait till I get all my other cards. You have no idea. I've got so many decks. Oh, my favorite decks, though, are in a, a different place in Colorado. Fuck. I knew I shouldn't have brought. <laughs> my psychic tarot cards are there. I know it. And then my love cards are there. You know, my patience, because this is coming. Abundance. Yeah, yeah. We love it. We love LA. Then you'll be able to relax. Actually, there will be no relaxation. The relaxation will be different. You'll be able to relax, but you'll be so busy. Lots of work to do, my friends. <laughs> Acceptance. Yep. Fuck off. That's what I was saying. It's not going to have accountability in here, but yeah. Acceptance. So, um, take accountability for your life. I know, this is just a hodgepodge of fucking nothingness. Hopefully somebody gets something out of any of this shit. <laughs> I'm saying. <sighs> it's a mystery, baby. Ask for help. I want to be your lover. I want to be your friend. Here's a pillow bite fat. Um, I saw a, a post and it was from Divine Elemental, I think. She's great. Um, I, I put it on my community tab. I shared it. What was it? It was something about sexual something a balance with sexual something and something else but i mean i was like nailed it that fit me perfectly it was really cool patience free spirit namaste namaste on this path namaste doing this till everyone gets it you either get it or you don't there's hope for the future have fun and be spontaneous. I'm going to go because I'm going to make me some coffee. I love you guys. Peace, peace, peace. I like to do that. <laughs> Namaste. And, um, mm, um, look up Reiki. Get a hold of me. I'm starting to sweat. <sighs> Hang on. All right, thanks, because I was getting so hot. I know, it kind of matches. I got this from Nikki, my daughter-in-law. She has my granddaughter. She's the cutest baby ever. She's the cutest chunky monkey ever. Oh, my God, she's so cute. She's so cute. She's got little teepees, and she crawls now. <gasps> Hers is a big girl. Hers is growing up so fast. Before I know it, she's going to be a teenager. Uh, <laughs> Miss Wright want to see her so bad. She needs her Grammy. Oh. All right. I love you guys. Peace and hair grease. And um, stay cool, man. Here's my little... Oh, gosh. And then I get my stuff. My singing bowl. My oyster shell. Freaking feather. All my cards. My massage table with all the soft and cool shit with it. And my bath bomb stuff so I can make fucking bath bombs. And my beads so I can make shit. Man, I'm going to want everything. But most importantly, my paperwork. Most importantly, my paperwork. Has anyone ever... Started a nonprofit organization or even looked into it, into, into the bylaws and everything. Yeah, I've already done all that shit myself. Mastermind at business, mastermind at money. I love my turquoise. Anyway, I don't know why I brought these out. This is raw kyanite, I believe, I think. This is Desert Rose. 
this is my, oh wait, or is this it? One of these is an, I can't remember. I can't remember now. Anyway, those go up there. I want to, I have them down for them. Oh, I don't want to put them back. Oh, shit. All right, I'm going to let you guys go because I'm just like, bleh. I love you. Peace be with you. Please, peace be with you. We're going to look up 48 again, but here's 13. Yeah, I'll do the um, intuition exercise later, maybe. Okay, I love you guys. Peace.